Hi, this is Maureen. I thought I'd do a video to show my haul from the recent CKC event that was in San Marcos last week. Um, I can't really remember the booths I got them from, but I wanted to show what I got. These were some stickers that I'll use for um, birthday cards. They were only a dollar a piece. And from that same booth, I also got some of these uh, mesh bling pieces that are kind of pretty. I like to cut these up, like cut a, uh, a row of like two or three or four gems across and use it in place of ribbon on cards. And my kids um, high school colors are purple and white and gray kind of so I can always use purple on their um, their friends graduation cards. And then let's see this is some uh, sticky paper by PK Glitz that is used to apply um, glue. I think that's the, I think this is just regular uh, double-sided sticky paper, but it's in um, sheets, you know, full eight and a half by 11 sheets. Um, and then this film though is Wonder Film, and this is a, eight and a half by 11 sticky sheet, but apparently you can apply it to fabric and then use their like super fine glitters on fabric and then actually wash them uh, in the washer. So I'll be giving those a uh, test and see if they work. I think I got this as a freebie. It's just a sheet of SEI stickers. I got it as a, as a freebie in one of the booths just for visiting. Um, this is a cuddle bug embossing folder. It's one die that both cuts and emboss, and I like that that pattern a whole lot. Um, I like anything that's real graphic-y like that. Um, and then I got a couple of these embossing folders by Darice. This one just embosses with sympathy on a card front. And this one is another geometric pattern that I did not have. Give you a close up on that. Isn't that cool? I could envision using this with like my Copics, I think. Oh, these are from a booth that was that jewelry um, that has um, the little ovals and things that you can fill. Like here's one that's a. Uh, large. No, these are medium ovals. These were large ovals and they were packaged up with I guess like 10. And then here's five large squares um, and then 10 medium squares were packaged together. And then I got the um, glass pieces that fit inside those once you've adhered your items. So I got square and the oval ones to fit those frames. And then I also found these um, organza necklaces that they've already kind of put together. And I know that, you know, I could go buy the pieces for this, but um, I know me too. <laughs> and I'm lazy and I'm not going to do that. So, um, so I just went ahead and bought theirs. They were in some pretty colors. So that's what I got from that booth. So that'll be fun. And I may try to use some of those with just some, um, glossy accents instead of their glass domes. Cause the glass dome is going to make it really heavy, I think. Oh, this is from the Stamps of Life. This is their new um, die that fits some of their alpha stamps that they have, and I'm pretty sure they fit. Uh, like I have this one. I think it fits that one, and it may fit this one too. So I look forward to doing that because I find I never use these, and I think I will if I have a die to actually cut the stamps out. She just released that I think a week or two ago. So that was fun to pick up. And I was good. That was the only thing I got from her booth. Of course I already have quite a few of her stamps. And uh, the line was so long it really made shopping in the booth 
near to impossible. So, and this was the <laughs> The only item that I told myself I was specifically going to buy was this uh, Wink of Stella brush glitter pen that we've seen so much of lately. Um, these were, and this was the only paper I ended up getting, was the Graphic 45 Bohemian Bazaar. You've already seen this. I, I think it came out early this year, and these were some chipboard pieces that go with that. But um, I already have so much paper and um, so I didn't really need any, but I had been been eyeing this one. Let me see if I can cut it open so you guys can see. They are two-sided, which I love. So I guess there's three of each. Aren't they just pretty? They're so bright and colorful. They're not that dark, kind of morose. Um, color palette like in the other graphic 45s. So I like this because they're a little happier. Um, let's see, I got several of these. This is kind of a crepe paper material. It was interesting. So I got it in several colors. Yeah, those were the three I got. And it looks like, I guess it's about six inches wide, but it's this it's just like thick crepe paper. Um, so I'll play around with that. That that looks like that'll be fun. And that booth also had some um, burlap kind of ribbon in several different colors. So of course I had to get several. I think they had a deal. Must have been... Well, let's see, I bought three, so there must have been a special if you bought three. Um, but so those are kind of cool for the burlap look. So I got the fall colors in those. Um, and they also had some bling sheets, which I thought were cool. Check these out. Are those not just the neatest? There's some that are gold. And these are more like... Let me bring both of these up a little closer and refocus so you can see. But so I can see the using these as flower centers or trims. Aren't those gorgeous? These look like almost like little records. My kids have no idea what a record is, but that's what it looks like. Um so that was really cool. And oh, and they also had a shoe that blingy stuff in the brown so so I got that and then there were just some random other like trims this trim looked really pretty whoop I already lost a little bling but that looked that looked kind of pretty I thought so I got that and let's see and then I got these things to use as flower centers these um and I've got a bunch of different colors that one has some that are pearl and some that are clear in several different sizes and then they had some kind of pearlized plastic ones and then here's some bright pink ones so I thought those were fun and then they had I got a yard each of these um I don't know what they are. They're some kind of ribbon, but uh, they're sheer. They're not rough like burlap. They feel much softer, and this one feels a lot softer here. But see how it has those irregularities going through it? So I thought that's pretty cool. Set those aside. That one that got away. Oop. Sorry. Thankfully, I can edit that out. Um, and I got some of these Prima wooden pieces. I had never seen these before. They're three different uh, sizes of frames. And then um, 